All right. Hey, hi folks. Welcome to another Mini Masters video. Um, I am playing. Uh, it's basically the Merlia deck, but as King Puff. Um, you just see how it's going. I was. I've been doing all right so far. We're kind of in the midst of a game. I'll show some of the games from uh, earlier. They've got some kind of, uh, unfortunately, they've got a uh, combo thing going on here. But we've got a combo thing going on, too. <laughs> All right, so this is looking pretty good. Alright, this is a, it's a nice push. Really chain lightning all these guys. Oh no. <laughs> cool. <laughs> We are going to take some damage here. Chain lighting. Oh, thought we were chain lighting for the win here. Whatever my partner is, then you kind of direct damage. 30. I guess he doesn't. He, oh, he could just shoot the base, dude. <laughs> He's not thinking. It's alright. I'm gonna get to my, uh. I'm gonna get to my thing. I'm trying to cycle to my chain lightning. Here we go. Chain lightning. We got it. We got it. There it goes. <laughs> okay, so this is some of the games from earlier. Let's see here. We've been about 50 50, I think. <laughs> See, so we lost those, we won these, yeah. It's been going back and forth. Um, is it from here? Let's start that. Alright, so that was actually really, uh. Okay, so I'll show this one first. I'll show like Welcome one or two others and we'll play another one. <laughs> so, one thing, uh, like the, really has that like end dragon and the healing, which is kind of nice, which I think I like a little bit better 
than the uh, the King Puff, but the King Puff's pretty fun. <laughs> so, um, so I threw in the tantrum uh, thrower so I could uh, do the rage. I think I um, I might have a little bit different build here. I was kind of trying out a couple different cards. So I think here we um, we totally uh, uh, punk these brothers of light. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the defensive chopper is pretty awesome. So that was a pretty good, uh, that was a pretty good, uh, Jolo, Yolo, Jolo, even though it didn't work. It was, a, it was a pretty nice, uh, try. <laughs> I put the Whirly Strat to protect, the uh, the Stixies. This one's uh this one's going well. <laughs> it's because funny 'cause the um, the era uh era, era Ragnarok or whatever. Um, I was playing them earlier um, on the uh, solo ladder. So he just kinda grinded it out today too. No, I kept getting like a one game away from uh uh, hitting master and then like losing and then going back is a nightmare. <laughs> so they're doing a, a bats, bats, bats thing, which actually um, got pretty pretty countered with the um, scratch artillery. The, the like not only the bats, 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 they're doing like some kind of like spirit infusion. It looks like. <laughs> And the brothers, the brothers of light are back, and uh, they're spirit infused now. And that that was actually a bad uh, Scott the sensitive savage. <laughs> but sorry, I make up for it with the uh, propeller horn. <laughs> So I think I actually take the propeller horde back out. I'm not sure. I have to look at the current build I got. I think I put it back to the uh, uh, the verbatim uh, list from the Morelia list with the shock rocks and the uh, scrat horde. Pretty good chain lighting, if I do say so myself. <laughs> so I think we, uh, we yeah, we're kind of dominating our experience. And I, I think that was a, a bad scratchillery. He, he should have put it right on the Spirit Mancer. But you know, whatever. He still wasn't bad though, I guess. Got in some damage. That was a pretty good uh, uh, shield totem. Jello, and then uh, I do the stun lancers with the succubus. Yeah, there it is. 
this. <laughs> I have the new skin for Valorian too, the dried one, so I'll have to play a Valorian just to show off the skin. Um, oh, so I did, okay, so I am running the Chantrum, and the, so I put it back. I was running uh, the Raidum uh, list for a while too, but I uh, took out the Shock Rock and I took out the Scrat Horde for the um, uh, Tantrum Throwers and the um, Scrat Pack or whatever. So, I think we'll show off, um, let's see, we'll show these two and then I'll, I'll play another one. And then I've got a crash, man, I've been up all morning. I am, uh, exhausted. Let's see here. So, if I, uh, if you guys are new to the channel or didn't know, I, I work nights, so uh, <laughs> sometimes I'm a little no. loopy. <laughs> All right, so um, my partner here is playing a Ritual Servitude deck, but um, he misdid his ritual somehow. Like he made it five mana. I think he might have put two rituals in his deck or something. So his rituals aren't right. They come out as uh, five mana rituals <laughs> which is really bad <laughs> yeah see you got demon warrior so I think what it was is he was just doubling up on the ritual and uh, <laughs> there's no bueno That was a bad uh, um, chain lighting on my part. And I realized that was a bad Scott the Sense of the Savage, so I switched him out of there. <laughs> that didn't help. He ends up getting wasted on the other side anyway. Propeller's can almost do some good work here. I say he's still kind of doing some good work. I remember this one being pretty rough on him. <laughs> and I think he was pissed because I loved uh, uh, birds too. Yeah, he's an assassin. <laughs> I didn't mean to. Blue just got the second perk. So I think I tricks off the yeah there I guess. Then propeller over to the side. And that uh trick swap uh almost gets us there. <laughs> So, uh, Scott says the Savage is doing some good work here. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately they play out uh, of the classes. 
I think I'm just trying to cycle to the chain lightning though. Um, the Whirlish guy was almost a hero there. <laughs> Actually, I miss it. I miss it, the chain lighting. That's right. I, I, I uh, didn't do my first rule again. Whenever you get a damage roll, you look at the, the health. <laughs> I think he missed it too, because I think the dragon alone would have killed it with the damage. So we both messed up. <laughs> Succubus? No. Yeah, there you go. Succubus finishes it. <laughs> Alright. Alright. I'm going to show one more and then we'll uh, play out one. Uno mas. So I guess we'll show with uh, Deja Vu. And since I've played this game before, and we're watching it again, it is like Deja Vu, really. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> Let's do it. All right. Now, for a second, when I saw the Vulture, I was wondering if they were doing my little combo combo deck. And they also have the T-A-S-S, but um, they're just kind of using it as crowd control. Well, I figure if you're running both of them, though, you might as well throw on the bazooka, bazooka scrap, you know? <laughs> well, it doesn't cost you that much more to have throw it in. You know, you don't have to, like, go a bunch of copies of it, but, you know. I mean, it is pretty nasty. <laughs> I told you I'm mighty. Yeah, so they, they actually have some nasty stuff going on here. I think it takes us a little while to figure out uh, how to get past all this jazz. So unfortunately, uh, when I played the Whirly Scrat, I just didn't want them to blow up the planes, but uh, it was kind of a, like, you, that stupid HEG-8 does so much damage, it killed the Whirly Scrat really, really fast. <laughs> I was kind of hoping to have, be able to Save the planes and keep the worthy scrap, but it didn't work out. <laughs> the drone buzzers. All right, this is looking pretty good. Oh, so the Bob, the the hero of the day here. <laughs> he just got murdered. <laughs> So, uh, <laughs> he was pissed that my trick swap Go, dodged his, uh, <laughs> his little, uh, machine guns. Thought it was kind of funny. <laughs> so my partner is bravely using Gorak Gate, too, which I, uh, I, I thought was interesting. Uh, I think this, um... Scott sensitive. Uh, I, th I was gonna say, oh, you know, he killed the mortar anyway. Let's say I thought he did good work there. <laughs> I 
I think I play the, uh, yeah, the tantrum throwers right there. And unfortunately, I didn't get the, uh, the scrat horde off in time to, uh, you know, save the Colossus. But they are going to get some sick damage in. <laughs> This is why you put them in the deck <laughs> for moments like that. the cleaver and Scott the sensitive savage I think uh, I think Scott gets some sick damage in here I think this is where he gets some damage in oh wait a minute okay dang it I must just always be rooting for him to get sick damage in <laughs> Cool, so they can't hurt the scrap tank. <laughs> they thought they could escape the whirly scrap, but they can't. No one can. <laughs> And so he's got death with resonant blast crystal, but I think I end up cycling through my deck to uh, get back to chain lightning. <laughs> if I remember right. There it is. 